Hi everyone, my name is Sean Connolly here for Rebrandly and today I'm going to quickly show you just how handy the tags feature is for organizing and sorting through all your branded links. So to start, let's log into our Rebrandly dashboard. As you can see, we've tons of links created here, so let's choose the most recent one for this example. This is a link to one of our recent blog posts. If we hover over the link, we'll see the option icons on the right. So here I'm just going to click on the pencil icon to edit. Now we can see all the info and stats for the link itself. So we're just going to click on add options in blue with the plus icon and then tags underneath that. Now, of course, if you're part of a workspace like ours here at Rebrandly, you'll already have a variety of tags in several different colors, all made by the administrator of that workspace to choose from. So for this link, I'm going to select the blog tag as it's a blog post and then the Sean tag, that's me, because I created the link. They will be added to your link info straight away. And once we go back to the dashboard, we'll see the listed link with the corresponding colors. If we hover over them, we'll see the tag names too. These tags come in extremely handy, of course, when searching for specific links. And if we click on the filters button up here, we're given the option to filter through our links by clicking on the relevant tags. So let's click Sean and blog post. And there we go. I found my link quickly and easily. Don't worry about having to scroll through hundreds of links just to find one. Oh, and one last thing. If you're in a workspace of your own, you can create tags as well. Simply do the same as before, clicking on your link, then add options, then tags, and you'll see the create new tag option. Here you can name the tag anything you like and choose a color to differentiate it. So to recap, log into your Brandly dashboard, choose the link you want, click edit, add options, tags, choose from already created tags or create a new one yourself. And that's it. Happy link sorting. So thanks for watching everyone, do be sure to let us know in the comments below whether you found this tutorial helpful and if you did, why not give us a like and subscribe as well, you know, it'd be, uh, it'd be nice. Do be sure to check out other videos on screen here if you want to see more tutorials and until next time, take care.